Okay guys, um, today I want to show you how to make this white effect between 3D viewport view and your rendered view. Okay, first you have to go to the camera and go into camera view. So now you just go to view and viewport render animation. So click here and Blender will render your camera view into frames like this according to the frame start and end. For example, I have 1 and 300, so 1 and 300. Okay, so apply the same step with your EV view. Okay, so now I press a shortcut button. Uh, control F12 okay after finish you will get this uh, the same like 3d viewport view okay until frame 300 so now we can close blender so I use DaVinci Resolve to edit my video open it you can get it free at the website Okay, so if you are first time using DaVinci Resolve, you can just go to Untitled Project and double click it. It will make a new project for you. And now we go to Edit Window. Okay, so open our folder. We uh, choose both of our turntable and subtract here. So just drag it at the clip name. So now DaVinci Resolve will automatically make uh, a video for you according to the image sequence okay so now the rendered one we will put it at the video track one and the viewport view we will put it on the top okay so now we choose this clip and go to inspector if you don't have it you have to click here and it will open this window so now go to cropping and double click this cropping and we are looking for crop right so if you push this scroll you will have a wipe out effect okay so now what i did before is uh, for example, I want to start wipe from here. I uh, click keyframe here, and you can see this symbol. When you open it, you have your keyframe. Okay, so I want to totally wipe the top clip here. So I just push it until totally wipe out. So now you are getting the wipe effect and to render you go to rocket symbol deliver so i just choose the preset setting for quick output and you can name your video and just put the location for example i just put it at the desktop and save and you have another option here for example the format change to mp4 uh, video codec this one rendered with gpu so add to render queue and yeah just replace it and then you can start render mm -hmm. 